Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is JD Tutorials here. I'm coming at you with another tutorial today. Um, today, I'm going to be showing you how you can use Photoshop to change a car's existing rim with another rim that you would like to see how it looks on your car, or something like that. Now, what you're going to need is the photo of the car and a photo of the rim that you would like to put on the car. Now, we're going to have to open the the car's picture. So let's go to pictures. Uh, nope. Okay, this is going to be the car we're going to be photoshopping. Now we need the picture of the rim. And this is the rim that we're going to be putting on there. And this is actually really helpful. It can tell, it can um, actually give you, you know, more thoughts on whether you should get this rim for your car or not. So, all right. Now, what we're going to use is one of the lasso tools. I recommend using the uh, normal lasso tool or the magnetic lasso tool. What the magnetic tool does is it automatically finds the pixels wherever you drag the cursor over just don't get too far away from what you're uh, selecting otherwise it will find another pixel to go over and there we have our picture now what you want to do is copy it you can either press control C or come up to edit and press copy now go to the car picture and press control V or you can come up to edit and press paste now you want to click on the first icon which looks like a cursor it's the move tool and we want to resize this right here so we're going to have to go to tr free transform make sure that you have layer one selected now to go to free transform you can press control T or you can go to edit and click free transform Alright, transform this more. And there we have our first rim put on there. Now we're going to have to put on our second one. Mm. Let's go ahead and resize this using the same controls that we just now used. And there we go. Now that's what you get. And that's how you um, put a rim on a car in Photoshop. So let's go ahead and preview this. Save it as a JPEG to my desktop. And there you go. There you have it that's how you put a rim on a car in Photoshop so if you uh, learn something from this and you like my videos subscribe rate and also comment whether the feedback is negative or positive I want to hear both sides so uh, thanks for watching